find some sort of validation or justification for why Roe reports deserved a brick. In I got a question for this cave. Hell, I got a question for you, Heifer. And other females right there. You saying she got hit with a brick. How come she don't got no missing teeth? How come she don't got a, a swollen jaw? I mean, and blood and, and of lacerations and blood is coming out. And you got a black, purple bruise. You know what I'm saying? I've been hit with objects, okay? So I can actually know what I'm talking about. And she's saying all the men don't defend her when she has, and when we have seen her on camera, hit me in the face, be violent, be toxic, and extra towards men. This, it had nothing to do with forward. It had so, a lot to do with her being violent first, being the aggressor, the, the, the stuff starter, and putting hands on men, and very being toxic and extra. And you're, gonna, and you're probably going to say, why, why did he leave? Why did her ass didn't leave? Why is the, she's equal to a man, remember? So how come if this dude was so violent, and it was, over, it was so violent, why did she run? Or square, I mean, if she squared up, it is what it is. But my thing is, how come she didn't try to de-escalate the situation by being soft, sweet, and feminine? Which actually the guys would be on her side. And she was minding her own business. No, she went around slapping men. She ran around being toxic. Now she talked about women are the providers and protectors. How come the women didn't defend her? And another thing, since she wants to, since this cave... K -k -k Karen, racist heifer. Yes, I'm calling you racist. I got a question. When the black woman got punched in the face by the white male, did you defend her? When you had Sandra Bland get wrongfully arrested and get body slammed and got unalived and lynched in jail in Texas, did you defend her? When you have black women being body slammed by these cops, when you have black women who got you got great by these police officers or by white males, do you ever hold your white males accountable? What if that was a white male who actually hit her with a brick? Would you be making that video? I told y'all, anytime a white female wants to defend a black female, black woman, she's not on your side. You have cases of white cave male exes of black women who swirled with, divested with, whatever you want to say, is she going to make sure you sh black women get justice for that, or she's just going to attack the black men while defending um, her race soldier sons and her crooked-ass, evil-ass daughters?